Yeah, he was like having a couple of days off in practice. And 10 years, I don't remember you, you know, during training camp taking days off. It was kind of different. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it was good. It was good to uh, just get a little bit of rest, kind of see things from afar. Something that Coach Patricia and I talked about a while back, and uh, you know, it's it's always hard for me to to take a little bit of a back seat, but it was good for me. Yeah, Matt, you just talk about the quality of your work when you get get out here in a situation like this against a team that you know is a very good one. Yeah, it's it's great. Um, they're a really talented team, like you said, both offensively and defensively. Um, present a lot of challenges, uh, you know, for us. Or uh, huge team on defense. Uh, um, you know, had some success in some parts and, and need to be better in other parts. So it was uh, it was a good day get, uh, getting some work done. Does it help with you in terms of your visualization and things like that when they're showing you things that maybe you're not seeing from your own good team every day? Yeah, absolutely. It's always good to get a little bit of change up. You know, day one against these guys, kind of figure out what they're trying to run and, and uh, figure it out on the fly, which is always fun. But uh, like I said, I mean, it's, they're, they're a talented team, um, great players at a bunch of positions, and uh, it's a good challenge for our team. Good, uh, Coach Patricia yelling for a little more tempo in and out of the huddle a couple times there. Is that a focus in general, or is that just something today? Yeah, it's something we're always trying to stress, you know, uh, just being in and out of there as fast as we can. If you get to the point of training camp and the preseason, we really start to sharpen up with the season coming. Things get a little, mean a little bit more as they go along. Yeah, we're, uh, you know, we're still grinding, you know. I mean, we're still, uh, I mean, out there today. Um, it's kind of next man up, it, it, you know. Today it was, and, and we had some guys running uh, that don't have. I don't have a ton of experience with, but it was great to get some work with them. So we're still in that in that phase. Everybody uh, going out there trying to earn jobs. How much you locked up a little late? I know you're a team guy, but when they ask you to take a couple days off, you're not a, a days off kind of guy. <laughs> how, how tough was it to, to just watch practice on the sideline? Yeah, it's not easy for me, but uh, it's probably good for me, um, you know, in the long run. So uh, something the coach. Uh, Patricia and I talked about and, and uh, probably the right thing to do, but uh, it was good. Gave me a little bit of perspective. Let me uh, coach the guys a little bit more even on the sideline. But, uh, yeah, it's, it's not easy as a competitor to sit out, but it's probably the smart thing to do. What do you think the physical benefit is? Uh, I'm not 21 anymore, so it's probably pretty good to, uh, if you can find a, a place in the schedule where you think you can get some rest and, uh, and uh, you know, just kind of feel fresh again, um, might as well. Can you Where does it take on an arm or a body, or you know what? You know, by the end of the season, can you feel like you feel like a different quarterback? At all? Uh, no, I just think it's I think it's smart too when you have chances, um, you know, to try to take care of yourself, um, you know, and try to uh, try to make sure that you're feeling as fresh as you possibly can. Um, obviously, you had a couple hard weeks there. There was kind of a, a little bit of a break in the action, um, you know, for a couple days, and then two quick ones at home. So we were like, might as well, uh, might as well do it. Your body feels good. Back yeah, feels good. Yeah. Yeah, I mean that's uh, you know there's a lot of guys vying for that position at the moment. Um, you know, got some work with TK today. He was running with the ones. Uh, Lacey was running with the ones. So, um, you know, I'm sure we'll be kind of filtering guys in and out, just trying to get experience with them and, and watch them, you know, perform. You know, that's what it's all about, making sure that they're doing the little things right, and then when the when they get their chances, uh, go ahead and make the plays. What are you going to try to accomplish in the next couple of preseason games? We're sort of getting to that point now in preseason. <laughs> What do, you want to, what do you want to accomplish with your doubles offense in general? Uh, I'd love for everybody to stay healthy, um, you know, and number two, go out there and execute a high level. Anytime we step onto the field, whether it's for a series or a game or a half, whatever it is, when we're out there, we're trying to execute at a high level, and uh, that's that's the goal every time we step on the field. Where's your comfort Matthew? level with, with the execution of your camp? I think it seems like you've, you've had some balls go where, where you wouldn't like them. Just, just wondering where your, your comfort levels with, with the execution through this point. So far. Um, I feel pretty good. You know, um, it's obviously a little bit of a different feel um, than offenses in the past, as, as every every one of them is. Um, but I feel good about it. Did you lose weight coming into the year? So why? Uh, you look like you were a little. No, I just probably lost 10 pounds today at practice. <laughs> no, I didn't mean that in a bad way. It just looked like maybe you did something different this offseason. Nope. Pretty similar stuff. Oh, you for you. Josh has really just dropped in. It seemed like he's picked it up far quicker than you expect any quarterback to pick up the scheme. How cumbersome have you been with just the way he's assimilated here in the first four days he's been on the road? He's done a nice job. Yeah, he's done a nice job. Uh, he's um, you know, a smart guy, obviously, to step in and be able to uh, to operate at any level really um, is, is good. And, uh, you know, he's gone out there and, and, and done a nice job. Can I ask What's up? Your break kind of coincided with him coming in. You said you Yeah. Oh, I don't know. You gotta ask him. Uh, I'm trying to be uh, a sounding board and help him as much as I can. But 
Um, he's a smart enough guy. He's a veteran in this league. He's played in a bunch of offenses, so he knows how to learn one quick and, and go from there. From your perspective, one, can you fathom playing on 13 teams in 10 years or whatever? What you would uh, that's, that's a lot of different teams, but uh, you know he's a true pro. He's come in here and, and been great. Right, cool. Thanks, guys. Thank you,